So I'm switching out my bags from this Speedy 30 to my Chanel tote. And I thought I should take a moment and film this for you guys. So um, I can do it quick. What's in my bag? And I don't believe, actually I know I haven't... I haven't shown you guys an unboxing for this new bag, but I've already been using it, um, and I'll show it to you guys now. So here it is, is a closer look. I've, uh, I do like to keep this one key chain on it or back charm on it. Um, I think it gives it, I don't know, a little bit more of a, a shine. <laughs> And I decided to put the lock that this bag comes with on the opposite side. So at all times you can see something. As you saw earlier, I put the, the sticker that I chose on the side of the bag instead. Um, so here's the inside. They all come with a red interior. Here is my first item. Uh, this is my wallet. And... I chose this wallet because it also has a red interior and it's the Emily style wallet, uh, one of my favorite designs from Louis Vuitton. And my next item here for you guys is going to be my small pochette. I have to do a review on that later. Um, this is just some cleaning wipes. And this is my other pochette from my Neverfull, kind of like my catch-all. This is just some cleaning wipes, I guess some more. This is something small for my baby. It's a little toy, actually. Um, sanitize, hand sanitizer. And you guys have seen this one before. Got lots of cards in here and business cards and lots of other junk I guess you can say <laughs> um, this gets used a lot usually because it's got very soft edges and I never have to worry about it scratching the inside of my bag and you guys have seen this one before my other pochette and let's see I've got my Louis Vuitton key holder and here's my newest item I'm going to post an unboxing here. I decided to purchase this item because I wanted to see the dark, the new dark red for this season. It was hard to purchase the minis or the cla or any other size of the classics, as this color was very popular. It actually, it was offered to me earlier this year, and I turned it down. Then, as time went by. I thought, you know, well, it'd be nice to see it in person, see if I really like it. Then I couldn't get my hands on the mini, but yet I found this SLG and I thought, okay, A, I can see the color. B, I don't have anything of this um, style SLG in my collection. So what a perfect reason <laughs> to purchase to purchase this one. So here it is. Um, this is the color and it might be a tad bit bright in this light right now. Um, I'll try to move it around so you guys can get a better feel or a look of the color. And you know, I'm a little bit underwhelmed. I'm not too crazy about this year's dark red. It's, to me, has like a burgundy undertone. But it is nice with this silver hardware. It does go good together. Um, and you know, I, overall, I'm, I'm happy that I have this item in my collection. So we'll see how, how it wears. And I don't know if I have another caviar SLG. For some reason, everything, any color that I like in Chanel ends up being lambskin. <laughs> and after what I saw happen to my Mew Mew, lambskin slg the pink one i've shown you guys in my earlier videos i'm a little bit skeptical about how they're all going to wear so as i use these items i will try to keep you guys posted if you want me to do any other reviews of anything you've seen in my earlier videos by all means send me a request and i'll do my best to do it for you 
All right, so moving on to the next item. Here's my Louis Vuitton coin purse that I've been using almost on every single one of my bags. And I just found the lid for my baby's toy. So I'm just putting that together before I move it on to my next bag. And here is the inside. Big, nice and big and very spacious. Here's a D-ring. And I have to give you guys a warning. If you get this bag, this red interior, this cloth, will, could, I should say could, rub off on any of your light SLGs. So my Azure SLGs have some red color transfer when I put them inside of this bag. I don't know if that's something I should have considered before using them. I've never heard of anyone else having any issues of color transfer from the inside of their bag. So very disappointing. I'm, I've gotten most of it off and I'm still working on it. So moving on, here is the D-ring for this Chanel bag. I, by the way, I don't use any of my D-rings. I, I wish I would. <laughs> Seems like it would make my life easier. Um, I'm going to kind of go fast here because I actually have to play around with the different compartments and see what works best for me. The middle compartment here does have a zipper, so more than likely I'll use uh, my wallet for that. The very back, uh, I'll just put my the bigger pouch as I don't reach for that as often as I do some of my other stuff. Um, but I have to say, I'm enjoying the different compartments of this tote bag. I mean, it definitely is easy to reach. Um, the leather feels nice and and supple and, and very flexible. So um, it's very gratifying trying to fit these items in there as there's a nice give to the bag. And uh, I just uh, like the organization. I feel that... Once I figure out where I want my items to be, I'll be able to find them much quicker and faster versus my speedy where everything's kind of thrown in there and you have to just shuffle everything around to find the item that you need. I probably should get an organizer for the speedy, but it took me a minute to fall in love with that bag. <laughs> so um, I like it more now than I did when I first received it. Um, but this one is definitely very practical for every day. The chain is very comfortable on your shoulder. It doesn't fall off. Look, it has a back pocket as well. So what would, what would I say? That's one, two, three, four, five pockets plus a zipper compartment on the inside. So that's six different areas that you can put it. And I think some, some more pockets in the very first one where you can put your cell phone, although I'll put mine at the very front of the bag but yeah not too heavy uh, I'm very satisfied with this and its organization is going to be very handy for me to use for my lifestyle and um, I think that I'm pretty satisfied with this one okay well that was it for this time hope you guys enjoyed have a great day or night. Until next time, thanks for watching.